Assalamualaikum. My name is Nurul Syakika binti Badamanan. Uh, I'm from Politeknik Menimah Melaka. I would like to compare about iPhone 6 and Huawei P7. This is Huawei P7 and this is iPhone 6. <clears throat> for display, I'm afraid we are going to start off with a disappointment for all you Apple fans as the P7 from the iPhone 6 in virtually every department regarding the display. Um, both phones have an LCD IPS screen with measure at 4.7 inch for the iPhone 6 and, and even 5 inch for the SNP 7. Uh, there's also now an iPhone 6 Plus which is has a honking screen of 5.5 inch throwing down the gauntlet to smartphone up like, like LG and Sony. <coughs> Uh, the Huawei handset start to pull away when we got a resolution and pixel density boasting a re resolution of 1920 x 1080 pixels as a density of 441 ppi compared to the iPhone's start of a 1344 x 750 pixels and 326 ppi. Of course, if you want to trim the iPhone 6 Plus, you get the full 1,920 x 1,080 pixel full HD. And 401 PPI screen which changes meter completely. Uh, for storage and memory, the SNP7 just about 8 storage and memory <coughs> runs as well with a uh, 2 GB of RAM compared to the iPhone 6 1 GB and having the advantage of supporting a Microsoft slot where, whereas the iPhone does not uh, however Apple come back strongly on the internet storage from run as the iPhone 6 is available in 16, 32 and 64 and 138 GB in comparison SN only offering a 16 gb version of the P7. <coughs> Camera, Apple Shop uh, commentators were raising their iPhone 6 with only an 8 megapixel camera with pressuring their users There's that this won't mean a drop in picture quality compared to the highest spec phone on the market. Uh, Huawei P7. Start off strongly in the camera department with 30 megapixel rear camera for HD video capabilities. <coughs> Xiaomi Apple battery 8 megapixels. <coughs> for size and weight, I always think of this section as the one where personal preference play the largest role. <coughs> Although in this case, there is only a rel relatively small difference between the iPhone and P7 in terms of dimension, the iPhone 6 measure in at uh, 137.5 times 67 times 6.99 <coughs> mm, whereas the SN P7 comes in at a slightly larger 139.8 times 68.8 times 6.5 mm. There is a noticeable difference in a weight top. The P7 weighs uh, 11 gram more than the iPhone 6, weighing 134 gram compared 130 for the iPhone. <coughs> if you go to the Kakia 6 Plus, though, you will getting a phone that that 7.1 mm thick comes in a at slightly larger 139.8 times 68.8 times 65 6.5 mm. There is a noticeable difference in the weight top. The P7 weighs 11 gram more than, than the iPhone 6 weighing 124 compared to 130 gram for the iPhone. If you go to Kraka 6 Plus, start you will getting a phone that is a 7.1 tick. <coughs> that being said, Apple hasn't included the slightly broad Today, camera lens in the thickness measurement something that Samsung took a lot of lack for in the past. Additional pages. Uh, this uh, further, despite rumors that Apple would cut out the head of the pack in terms of smartphone screen innovation using layers of several inter inter 
preset with glass in order to make the screen harder and more stretch resistant that didn't seem to happen so maybe we haven't seen then end of the famous shutter front iphone screen with the iphone 6 thank you